start tonight at the Capitol, where one lawmaker is making a push to keep alcohol out of the hands of minors. See what you think of his idea, because News Force Tanner De Leon spoke with the bill's author and has more. Tanner? Well, the issue here is self-checkout registers, and while scanning beer or wine, it'll call an employee to come check your ID. All our minor has to do is keep that alcohol in their cart. Senate Bill 1866 made its way through the Senate committee hearing today. If passed, it would ban alcohol sales at self-checkouts. What we're seeing across the country right now, especially with young people that are using self-checkouts, uh, to steal basically beer and wine, and they're doing it in a clever way. As it stands now, if you scan alcohol at a self-checkout, an employee comes to check your ID. But Senator Coleman, who wrote the bill, says that presents an easy workaround for minors. They just don't scan the alcohol. I would imagine they're clever and they watch out when the self-checkout person is busy and, and, and slide the greeting card across without the beer sliding across. So what this would do, it would ban the self-checkout of, of beer and wine in stores in Oklahoma. But some oppose the idea. Why should the government be involved in regulating this rather than just individual businesses? Senator Coleman says staff monitoring the self-checkout area is not enough. I know when I go through a self-checkout and get beer or wine, it pops up, this person's ID needs to be checked. But if they're not scanning the beer or wine, then it's not going to pop up to check their ID. And that's where you see the biggest issue right now in the state. That is the biggest issue in my opinion right now. And if this bill becomes law, this is how Senator Coleman envisions it. I would envision that they would have to have just a lane for beer and wine purchases or anything else that would have to be manned by a real person who would be checking IDs and making sure those items are indeed charged and the person buying them is indeed 21 or over. Senate Bill 1866 will now head to the Senate floor to be heard and voted on.